Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today I will be reading for you Martin Luther King. Okay, Martin Luther King Jr. was a black man and he was born in the USA on the 5th January 1929. So he was born in born in the USA on 5th January 1929. Let's continue. As a child, he enjoyed playing sports playing the piano and going to school sadly life was often difficult so he enjoyed playing sports and playing the piano and going to school but sadly life was often because it was difficult some people treated him different based on the color of his skin so some people treated him um, uh, treated him differently based on his color of his skin because he was he was a black man at the time there were separated areas for black people and white people on bub on public transport so at the time there there was there were separated areas like bathroom public bathroom and and uh, restaurants and um, uh, even schools so uh, in the in parks restaurants and even the toilets I said it furthermore up until the one one million nine hundred and and the sixties, black people in the states of the USA could not vote in elections. So furthermore, up until the one million and nine hundred and sixties, um, uh, black people in some states of USA, a uh, US could not vote in elections. Let us continue. Black child, but, uh, sorry, uh, black children were not permitted to go school with white children. So black children were not permitted to go to school with white children. Why? Let's see. Um, uh, they had to go to separated schools that didn't have many resources to help with their learning. Learning. Oh, um, uh, so they have to go to separated schools that didn't have that many resources to help with their learning. Okay. Martin Luther King Jr. was determined to make sure that all Americans had the same rights regardless of his of their races race so he became a civil rights activist. So Martin Luther King Jr. was determined to make sure that all Americans had the same rights regardless of the race so he become a civil rights activist. This means that he campaigned for improved rights for people. Oh, uh, this means that he campaigned for improved uh, rights right people. Martin Luther King Jr. went on organized other nonviolent demonstrations against the unfair treatment of black people. So Martin Luther King Jr. went on to on organize organize other nonviolent demonstrated against the unfair treatment of black people in in million 
906 kez huy Martin Luther King Jr. led a huge march in Washington D.C. So in uh, 1,916,3, Martin Luther King Jr. led a huge march in Washington, D.C. The, the U.S. Capitol here in front of a crowd of 250 thousand people king made his famous i have a dream speech so uh, capital here uh, the usa capital here in front of a crowd of 250 thousand people king made his famous i have a dream speech Let's continue. Here are some George extract. Oh, this is the end. Okay. Uh, now we have the million nine hundred and fifty-five bus boycott. And million nine nine hundred and fifty-five Rosa Parks, a black woman was arrested for after refusing to give up her seat on a bus to a white man so in in million and nine hundred and fifty five rosa parks uh, a black woman was arrested after refusing to give up her seat on a bus to a white man Martin Luther King Jr. called on black Americans to protest by not traveling on buses. So Martin Luther King Jr. called on black Americans to protest by not traveling on buses. Let's continue. In that area, oh, in that area, this protest lasted for 385 days and ended with a United States court ruling that ended separated area for black people and white people on all multi public buses. So, um, uh, this protest lasted for 385 days and ended with a United States court ruling that ended separated areas for black people and white people on all multi-degree pub public buses. So that's all. I hope to see you soon. Bye.